so cold here. I want to go somewhere warm. Okay, let's go. We're Natalie and Larry, and today's adventure, we're searching for dolphins, checking out local attractions, good food, places to stay, and maybe a pineapple willy or two, because this is Panama City Beach, Florida. Welcome, Welcome to, to Panama City Beach. Known for spring breakers and white sand beaches, but what is Panama City Beach like in the off season? So we're headed down to the beach. We're here in Panama City and it's November what, 2nd? November 2nd? Yeah, and it's 70 degrees out right now. 80 so. degrees, babe. 80, sorry. It's November. Merry Christmas, guys. <laughs> One of the attractive reasons why we love Panama City Beach in the off season is the lower crowds. There are less people on the beach and also places like the famous Pineapple Willies, you can get in right away. Where are we going? Pineapple Willies. Pineapple Willies. Pineapple Willies historical pier was the beach's first original pier, serving mostly seafood, but more importantly, the ultimate drink stop. You even can get a discounted refill with your reusable mugs. The best time of day is, of course, sunset, right? Now let's talk about where we're staying. Hey guys, check it out. So we're staying out here at Panama City Beach at uh, Lake Town Wharf and uh, this beautiful condo that we were uh, able to be hosted at. Uh, it's on Verbo, Airbnb, and uh, Legacy. Uh, we'll put the links down in the channel below so you can uh, rent this condo yourself if you'd like to see it. But uh, it's a beautiful place, and we're gonna go right inside here. We're gonna take a look, okay? Welcome, follow me, I'll show you around. This view is spectacular. Located on the 15th floor, 160 feet up with views of the Gulf. This is why we like this condo. I think this is where you're going to be finding us for most of the time. Well, let's also show you around, so step inside. The condo has a primary suite, two full bathrooms, washer dryer, and can accommodate up to six people. Check out these bunk beds, even for us big kids. Larry, tell them about the kitchen and the living room. Nice open space, full-size refrigerator, dishwasher, coffee maker, Keurig, stove, oven, microwave. I mean, you don't even have to leave the place if you don't want to. You can check out this amazing vacation rental on the links down below in our description box. You're not going to want to miss this opportunity to stay in this beautiful place on the Emerald Coast, white sand beaches, blue ocean waters, Family fun, on season, off season, no matter what it is, this is a great place to stay. Thank you to the owners of this beautiful condo for hosting us. Lake Town Wharf has so many amenities right on property. I think there's like, there's like a seafood restaurant, there's like a taco place. Wow, so you never even have to leave the resort if you don't right. want to. Oh, this is Lulu. Yeah, this has like karaoke or live music on certain nights. We stopped at Lulu's one night to get a cocktail, but us early birders might have arrived a little too early. Still very enjoyable. It was time for more coffee as we checked out this cute little shop, The Press. So I got the bourbon caramel latte, no whip, and oat milk. And this is so good. 
I took one sip while we were taking pictures and I was like. <laughs> so I'm trying the honey cinnamon Americano and it's very cinnamon forward, which is very good for me because I like cinnamon, so cheers. We are on our next adventure for today. Where are we going? Uh, he doesn't I, even know. I it's called... <laughs> my, my mind went blank. He didn't have enough coffee this morning. It's called Gulf World. Gulf, Gulf World. Golf? Golf. Golf. Golf World? I'm from Chicago. I say golf. golf world. Okay, so we're going to Golf World and we're going to see some dolphins, sea lions. Um, don't they have flamingos? I think so, or birds or something, aviary. I don't know. We're going to see, so come along with us well, as we, we take you. Check it out. <laughs> Another reason we like the off season, because Front Beach Street is not busy. Golf World has daily educational shows, interactive programs, and has contributed to the study and conservation of marine mammals for over 20 years. Home to California sea lions, harbor seals, bottlenose dolphins, and tropical birds and more. They are dedicated to the rescue, rehabilitation, and release of marine mammals and sea turtles. when Larry sings to her. <laughs> I think you're pretty too. <laughs> Sophie likes you. You got a friend. She's, she's totally hitting on you. I think she's hitting on me. If you are liking our video so far, please like and subscribe and share. We appreciate your support. So what did you think? It was pretty cool? Yeah, I thought it was a pretty cool um, thing to do here in uh, Panama City Beach. I think it's a really family friendly. It's not huge, which is also a plus because then you have like time to go and do some other things. Um, yeah. What time we got here at 11? Yeah, two, two and a half hours max yeah. is all you need. Uh, and we saw all the shows and the attractions. Some things to be aware of though, we did come in the middle of a school field trip and <laughs> um, you know, there were a bunch of children running around. It was fun, but uh, at the same time, it got a little crowded yeah. at some times, at some points, so. But uh, we're definitely here in the off season. It's really cool and educational. Um, it's down there. Ugh. Ugh. No, look at these guys. Uh, learned a lot about the dolphin, seals, sea lions. Um, there's birds. One of them tried to take my man. <laughs> but it's a great thing to come and do. We're headed to our next attraction, which is shopping and dining. <laughs>
heading back to the hotel to use the amenities. So in the summer, the Splash Bar and the Sunshine Grill are open. So I'm assuming because of the off season. There are five outdoor pools with hot tubs, and of course we wanted to try out the rooftop one. Check out these views. Cold? Yes! <laughs> Two-story fitness center and putting green. After all that fun, we're ready for some dinner. Because you don't know when zucchini. <laughs> we're just using up what we have. the cheese and I have the hash brown on top of the sausage and the biscuit is just like buttery it's really good it's very fresh very fresh it's made to order here yeah nothing is like made pre prior so it's not fast food they said it's made to order so even the drive through you have to wait to get your food yeah so. and by the way the drive through line goes all the way around the building right oh, yeah. now this is how popular this place is yeah and it's only open from like six to two
Okay, we just finished doing the dolphin cruise with Sea Screamer and we had a great experience with them. I think the boat was actually pretty new. It said it was under a year old. There was about 80 of us on the, the boat, but it wasn't, it didn't feel overly crowded. Allowed to get, get up and kind of walk around. You can purchase snacks and drinks on board. It's a two hour venture and we saw dolphins like the entire time. Dolphins were surfing three times. He said, don't expect that every time you come out. Yeah. So if you can imagine that it was, it was a phenomenal time. Now let's get some grub island style. Fresh, simple, and delicious ingredients. And inside, there's a barista bar featuring organic lifestyle, serving all vegan and vegetarian. Photographer in the wild. What? Content creator in the wild. Look how pretty she is. She's so cute. She's hangry. <laughs> she might be a little hangry right now. I think this was one of the freshest tacos that we've had. Of course, we didn't forget to catch that famous sunset. Thomas Donut and Snack Shop since 1971. Window service, picnic tables, and some of the best donuts we've had. Okay, so, of course, there's a key lime filled uh, donut here. Of course, you know I had to get that one to try that one. And I got a cinnamon sugar. You know me, you know I'm a red velvet girl. So I got the red velvet. And if you also know me, you know I love lemons. So I got the lemon filled. Do you share food? Comment below. So the sand is very soft and squeaky, just like it is all over the Emerald Coast. Just like Pensacola Beach, just like 30A. I love it. The water is blue. This is November, guys. November in Panama City. What do you think? And for a hidden gem. This is a potato salad. I'm vegan. Potato salad. I like this. Well, I think they, they have their own garden here, so there's a lot of uh, this is very fresh, fresh, very fresh ingredients, so. I think even Larry enjoyed the menu, too. Is it vegan now? <laughs> I'm not hating on it, that's for sure. Oh, I'm so glad we tried this place. See, trying new different things. Places that are off the beaten path, and it's right off the beach. Yeah. Panama City Beach in the off season. Thank you so much for following us. Until next time, we'll see you there, there and back. back. <laughs>